Hey, hey, baby, I'm home. Oh, God, you won't believe the day I had. <laughs> you remember Tim? You know how I've told you before how he's clumsy all the time? Well, today he managed to trip and spill coffee all down one of the investors and... Oh, they aren't on the couch. Huh? Weird. Usually they're sitting there reading or at least watching. Okay, maybe they're in the kitchen. They usually go in there for a midnight snack. Hello, baby. Are you in here? Not in here either. God, where are they? Oh, God, you big idiot. They did say they were going to be studying later. Especially since it's quieter at night in the library. Remember, they told you. God, it really has been a long day. Hmm, hold on. Is, is that their phone? That's weird. They never go to the library without their phone. Come to think of it, their keys are still here too. Maybe the library was closed this time. Baby, are you still here or... Have they got headphones on? Hello, sweetheart, are you here? Okay, no answer. Maybe it's in the bedroom then. They might have actually listened to me about taking a break for once. God, they are so stubborn sometimes. Although that's one of the things I love about them. God knows, they probably haven't even left the computer. It's probably got to be so uncomfortable. Hey, you in here? Silence once again. Maybe they fell asleep. I mean, God, they have been working themselves to the bone recently. Hey, sweetheart, are you asleep? Okay, if you don't answer, I'm going to come in. Hey, look, I know you don't want to be disturbed, but I think it's time you took a break. No. Oh my God, baby. Baby, hey, come on. Wake up. Fuck, how long have they been lying here? Fucking idiot, why didn't I notice they weren't feeling okay? Okay, okay, breathe. Okay, I think I got it. I need to grab some pillows to elevate them. It might help them get blood back to their head. Okay, love, you, you're going to be okay, I promise. Ah, okay, um, how did he do this? All right, Th these two go under your head and these two under your legs, okay? There, you you're elevated now, baby. Come on, please wake up. <sighs> God, did they even take a break? Fuck me, they've probably been working since I left this morning. Baby, come on, wake up. Baby. Are you waking up? Oh, fucking God. <laughs> hey, hey, there you are. Hey, 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 baby. Hey, there's those pretty eyes I like to see. Hey, whoa, 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 hold your horses. Don't get up right away. Yes, I'm serious. Stay down. You need to keep yourself elevated. Why? Honey, you, you passed out and... I'm a little concerned that you might have hit your head when you fell. Are you feeling okay, though? Do you, do you feel dizzy at all? Sweetheart, if you can please tell me what happened. Okay, let me get this right. You were still working without a break. And so then you decided to get up because you felt thirsty. So you wanted to go grab some water and then... And as you stood up, you felt funny, and it was all fuzzy from there. That's all you remember. Oh, baby. <laughs> hey, do not blame yourself for this. This wasn't your fault, okay? It happens. 
But love, what have I said about working yourself too much? Sweetie, I know you have an exam coming up and I know fully well you want to do your best and all. And I know how important this is to you. But you've got to understand that you need to take it slow. If you push yourself past the breaking point, you're going to drain yourself more than you already have, especially your sleep, love. But baby, I know you. And I noticed how you've been skipping meals when I'm not around. I can see it in your eyes. Tell me when your exam is due. The 14th. See, love, you have lots of time to study then. You, my sweet little pumpkin, are going to relax this weekend and I'm going to pamper you whether you like it or not. Yes, I do need to. And you can't do anything about it, you little gremlin. What do you think I'm doing? I'm picking you up, obviously, and I'm taking you to bed. No, not like that, you dummy. That can be saved for another time. If you're not going to look after yourself properly, then I'm going to. Like I said, I wasn't kidding about taking care of you. And I know you're not used to having someone help you and comfort you. But that's why I want to be able to do that for you, my love. Hey, no arguing back on this. I am not doing this out of pity. I'm doing this because I love you deeply. And I want to show you how much you mean to me. You're mine to take care of. So let me take care of you. So you, my sweet dumpling, are going to stay right here. Get all cozy and comfy, put on any show you want. Yes, especially that one, of course. While you do that, I'm going to order you your favorite food. Yes, of course, from your most favorite place as well, my love. But firstly, I'm going to get you some water because you need to stay hydrated. Yes, you need to. Water is an essential to have and you, my little flower, need it. Mm. I'll go grab some water and a little snack to go alongside it for you. Oh, and before I forget, do not, and I repeat, do not touch that computer because I will throw it out the bloody window if you do. So stay in bed, relax, and I'll be right back to give you all the love and attention you need. Yeah, <laughs> I know, I'm a big mother hen, but... Don't deny you love it. <laughs> I'll be right back. Mwah. I love you.